Silent Light was a Christmas tree commissioned by the Victorian Albert Museum in 2003. Alexander McQueen and myself both felt we didn't want to create ornaments for an existing tree, but we'd rather make the whole tree ourselves. So we asked Swarovski if we could please have one and a half tons of crystal, <laughs> and I said yes. <laughs> With the expansion of the crystal world, it gave us the opportunity to create a whole room around the silent light tree. I aim to create work that on one hand is very contemporary and modern, but at the other hand is also very human and often romantic. And crystal helps in that way because it, it does bring a kind of glimmer of romance and glamour. Over the years I worked on 12 different projects with Swarovski. The Blossom Chandelier was the first item that I designed. Nadia Swarovski asked me to design a chandelier for the Crystal Palace project. My aim was to bring a romantic feeling back to the world of chandeliers. I often long for a world that's warmer, more humane, and I use nature as a way of creating this world. I want to make this jewellery that was made out of almost nothing. I used cherry pips for my aunt's garden and I used the crystal as a contrasting material in between. I've also designed a jewellery line for Atelier Swarovski, which includes the Blossom Lace. This is a necklace that's based on the Blossom Chandelier. I think Swarovski and I work very well together because it's a very fundamental understanding what design can contribute. 